evidence suggests that increasing vitamin D levels may reduce the risk of developing several chronic diseases, including Alzheimer's disease, autoimmune diseases, cancers, cardiovascular disease, ischemic heart disease and stroke, type 2 diabetes, hypertension, chronic kidney disease, stroke, and infectious diseases such as acute respiratory tract diseases, COVID-19, influenza, and pneumonia. Randomized controlled trials on vitamin D supplementation have been unsuccessful, likely due to poor study design and analysis. To estimate the expected reduction in incidence and mortality rates of vitamin D-related diseases in Saudi Arabia and the UAE, researchers used the best available evidence from ecological and observational studies, randomized controlled trials, mechanistic studies, and Mendelian randomization studies. Based on these findings, they estimated that raising serum 25-OH D concentrations to 30 nanograms per milliliter would result in a 25% decrease in myocardial infarction incidence, a 35% decrease in stroke incidence, A. This article was authored by William B. Grant, Fatmi Alanudi, Barbara J. Boucher, and others. We are article.tv, links in the description below.